G'day guys and welcome back to Adults Craft AP Java. So today if you look behind me there, you can um, see a bees nest in the background there. So what we're doing today is we're just going to go and make a bit of an enclosure for uh, some of the bees that I've got here. And hopefully all the um, baddies are all gone and despawned burnt up. Now here we have the automatic um, collection system for honey bottles. Okay so we've got a whole heap of honey bottles in here. Now you've got to leave at least one space blank otherwise the honey bottles just get chucked from from here out and they land on the ground so yeah make sure you leave that and making the system you leave one square there and uh, this is I believe it's a wattles design as you can see these bees are getting lost and just sort of starting to wander away by themselves. So we're hoping to eliminate that by building a bit of an enclosure. He's slowly coming back. That's going to be within these boundaries here. And up here, I did have another one uh, right here. But it's going to be too close for this here because that's the entrance for the beehive so I'm going to move it out I've got this, this over top of my AFK fishing spot which I don't actually use anymore um, so we can probably get rid of that and we can just build right over top of that so we're going to put dirt in there and let's start building this build I want it to come out one more so it's going to have to I mean the roof overhang is going to hang out over here so um, go let's go like this three high and then a roof no maybe four high Ooh, uh, okay, I'll never have to go into this area. This boy. Well, I'll put a trapdoor to so I can access into this to put bottles into it, but I shouldn't really need to go in within these boundaries. We are going to have to move this one over though. Drop that down and move it over. Okay, three, three high will be fine, I think. By the time we put the roof on, it's going to be a wee bit higher than that yet. So I'm thinking, look at these bees, they're just wandering everywhere. Crazy. So I'm going to finish off doing this and, and I'm going to clear off this section and I'll. Be right back here. Okay, so just level off all this terrain here, and now we can start placing down these blocks. I'm just gonna grab these ones, and there's gonna be one row at the bottom of these to go around this thing, and it's gonna be on the inside here, not there. My bad. All right, and we'll carry on doing this. So we're probably going to go up one more. I'm picking. This will be an, there'll be enough room there. Hopefully they don't get stuck under there. Like that one looks like it's gotten stuck, but. enough room for them right well 
we'll find out, won't we? It's just like that. This, this should be a big enough. Oh, this one's stuck because it's on the lead. Yeah, so once I get this done, I'll take this guy off the lead as well. The only reason he's stuck there. Okay, so we're going to keep this pretty simple, this build. It's going to be similar to this over here, um, which is very, very, very simple. Um, but it works. So now what we are going to do is we're going to start laying in some of these corner panels. And I think I might just go with uh, spruce planks for that. And we'll just put this up here. Uh, gonna have to raise this up anyway. But I think I think this is we need to go with that. Raise those up. Do this one here too. Because it's pretty basically a glass house. Well, along the lines anyway, so pretty simple build. Yeah, we've got that done. Now we want to go put Hmm, trying to think here. Should we do it traditional? Well, just do this. I mean, I want to see what's going on in there. I want to see them flying around, so oh, it's going to be filled in glass panes. I may even put a skylight on this thing. Okay, and I'm going to need some more of them. That little guy's really stuck, isn't he? Okay, so we've got this here now. Um, yeah, very simple. I use stone and stairs on the outside uh, to go over the roof, and this is going to overhang a fair bit. I'm going to overhang it one past this, so my bed. Um, let's go like that, and then like that. overhang like this. Okay, so I'm going to do this all the way around. Come back when I've done that. Okay, so we've got the last one going in now. And yeah, covered right around. That's, that's our hangover for our roof. So this gives it a bit of depth, having this, this step out at the corner. Uh, as well as having these overhang right out to the outside. A good look. So now for this to work properly, we're going to have to. Uh, I'm thinking I'm going to put a piece of dirt here, um, and then I'm going to have to get a trap door and place it over here, open the trap door up and then break it. Uh, and that will enable me to get into there. But for everything else I think on this side we might just do uh, full glass blocks. I would prefer to do panes. Um, and it 
it's not going to really connect here with the plane bar. So I think yeah, this side will do a full size block. So not there. Yeah. Get the way, buddy. Oh, move out of the way. Move out of the way. Good man. Just like that. Yeah, I know it's going to look a little funny here. Um, but I don't think it's going to matter. It's going to matter too much. Right, so for the sides, we're going to use uh, panes. So, go through here, and then there. Okay, so that looks that looks really good actually. This it's a shame I didn't do that over here. I could probably do like a window here and have this a window here and just have this locked right off. It's just gonna look funny because it's a bit uneven, but it's okay. Most of these done. Perfect. That one looked pretty good already. Do the same here. Just like that. And it's just a matter of filling in this up here and the roof. Now, do we want a glass roof? Hmm. Do we want to have a glass roof? I'm not a hundred percent sure I do. Um, hmm. No, I think I think I might go with oak. Might go with oak. I'll, I'll be back in a second. Okay, so what we're going to do is I think we're going to go for a bit of a mixture of both the glass and oak. First, what I want to do with the side here is hmm, where did all my bees go out of the nest? Surely they can pop out. Yeah, there they go. Cool. Okay, so what we're going to do here is because I've got so much of this grey wall, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and pull in this ring that's around the top grey wall. And we're going to do that all the way around. Whoa, almost fell off. We'll do this all the way around here. And then we'll start building on top of that. B. I have to keep an eye on these bees and make sure they come back in before I actually seal it right up. Um, Imagine that. Yeah, it's pretty good. They must have like a path winding. They can find the pathway to back to the um, nest or hive. 
Okay, so now we've done this. This and this. I think I'll do the top, but I'll probably have a flat top in the middle, and that's just so we can actually just seed straight in. But I think I'll just do this and do around here with oak. And we'll see. Gonna look. I think it'll be fine. I don't think it'll be overboard. But I think two of my bees have gone missing out of this this hive. It should be pretty close by. Now I only go at least 128 blocks away. It's all loaded up. Yeah, so this is looking alright. I think we'll do. Um, let's see. Need more of those so make another a bunch of these we'll make some more of these and we'll sleep the night away come back okay now we need to put I could actually fill this in with something cows um, but I think the easiest thing is just to double on him down and we'll just keep on moving around. And then we can uh, flatten this off with some um, plain glass blocks. Okay, I'll finish doing this and I'll come back. Okay guys, so I've put a few of these blocks in here already to see how it looks. I think it looks fine. I think it looks good actually. I think I'm going to wrap it up. Now we do need to find the other bees, but if we can't find them, well we'll just have to breed some more I suppose. Um, yeah. Need to put some more. We need more going on inside, so we're going to have to put some more uh, bushes and whatnot in there. Also, yeah, we're going to have to find those bees. And maybe we might even add some sort of access door into this. Now, I thought what I could do is, where it's all grey around there, up there, I could put maybe a row of dirt and put some more flowers on there so there's actually flowers up around the top too and of course we need to decorate the outsides here Got bees here I'm gonna have to find those other bees but look it's up to 16 already it's an extra 8 extra 8 in there since I started I'm picking that's actually off one B. Maybe two. Okay, let's get a um get a trapdoor. Walk that out. Up over here, I think. I think we'll just make um should we make spruce? No, I oh. Yeah. Bruce trapdoors are good. Bruce trapdoor. Pop it on there, we'll break that dirt out. That'll be the access there. Just like that. Okay, so we can restock these bottles when 
you need it, but that, that, that's going to run for a long time. Um, I need to go over this and just clean up some of the areas. But actually, I think it's going to do the trick. I think it's going to be fine for what what I need, and it's just to contain these bees and keep them in here. And it looks gonna look all right from the sky too. Oh yeah, look at that! I can actually, see through right through that glass. Yeah, a few more flowers in here. I think the dirt around the top layer there with the, the single little flowers on top. That's gonna it, bring a lot more color to it and uh, it's going to keep some of these bees happy as well so guys if you uh, you like what you see here on the, on the adults craft AP Java server um, maybe you could subscribe and uh, leave a like definitely leave a like and See you in the next one. Bye.